welcome back everyone and we're beginning our special breast cancer awareness week tonight for so many women the challenge is a tough one and can take its toll of course but there are many resources out there to help patients and survivors look and feel their best our carrie drew shows us how i am double stage four cancer with my breast and my bones so i will never be quote cancer free Weeks after Patricia Blackwood was diagnosed with cancer last October, the mother of two from New Jersey got this tattoo on her wrist. It says strength. I needed something besides my mind to just look down on and to just keep me going and give me strength, and it does. Staying strong even during chemotherapy. And then there was the hair loss. A month into my treatment, I noticed that I was starting to lose my hair and I wanted to make that transition before it was all gone. Through her research, she found Andrew D. Simone from Hair Place NYC on Lexington Avenue. He specializes in wigs for women dealing with cancer. Women just want to fly under the radar, and our wigs definitely help them do that. Andrew's wigs come in dozens of styles, and all of them are hand-tied, a process that makes the wigs look more natural. If I part the hair, and I separate it, it looks like scalp. One hair at a time, hand crocheted to a stocking thin cap that sits on your head. It's a perfect solution for a woman going through chemotherapy because they go on and off daily. I felt so beautiful that it actually, I had taken pictures of myself and sent them to my family and they were like, wow, they like, that kind of looks better than your, your, your original, like your hair, <laughs> you look better. Andrew says it's hard to describe what it feels like to help. I think the best part is the hug. When, when, they, when they look at themselves in the mirror and they just give you a hug. It's one less mental problem that you need to go through. And it just makes that process so much easier because I am such a firm believer of if you look good, you feel good. And I feel I look good and I feel good. I had been looking around for clothes that would look beautiful while I was recovering, that would address my needs, and I couldn't find them anywhere. So the night before... <laughs>